What's up, what's up everybody? Welcome back. Don with the Don Franz Show. Today, quick video, I'm going to go over uh, a, a Shell Tortoise Acquisition Group, Hylion, the company. They're about to do a, a reverse merger on this one, so I want to give my breakdown. Uh, this is a very big, uh, a popular one inside the, the Mentor Group. I talked about it last night. We actually had a perfect play on it today. Uh, and right now, we're just riding, riding the gravy train and why I think it's actually going to continue. So first off, last night... Uh, I talked about this, right? And we had, this is what we saw. A rejection right here, but we started to make higher lows. Now, in general, this move is what put this on the radar for me. And I saw us holding up right here. This is the previous zone. And then we bounced this zone to zone, but I saw it get just bought right back up. We started making higher lows. So this morning, that little gap up let me know, okay, it's, it's time to get bullish. Here comes the breakout. We got the perfect type two, and then it just shot up. So this thing was absolutely amazing. Even gave plenty of time for people to get in it. Uh, I know a lot of people in my group got in it, and we're just off to the races right now. Now, what this is, is a again, a reverse merger, very similar to what Nikola did. If you guys, I know a lot of people like that one, where it went from like 30 something dollars to $80 in one day. Now this merger set to take place on the 16th up to the end of the month. So, give yourself some time on this if you plan on playing options. But I do think now that we got the final breakout, we're getting closer. I think now these, these final couple weeks, we're going to see the run up into it. Maybe we see some sideways consolidation after a nice run, kind of like we did here. And then another pop, maybe we stair step our way up. But with the way everything's running these days, with the retail crew running crazy, um, reverse stocks, or not reverse stock splits, sorry. Um, split, stock splits happening. We saw the Apple and Tesla craze get into it. It just seems like we're taking some bit of this news and we're just running it into the date. Now, I do think this is probably a buy the rumor, sell the news event. I don't think I'll probably take off most of it before uh, before the 16th. Uh, we'll see what news comes out and see if we're going to extend that or not in the meantime. But I, fundamentally speaking, I like this company. They make all the important. They make the guts of a semi truck. So we got the frame, the wheels, the drivetrain, all of it. Now the company just needs to put the body on it. Similar to like Tesla making their own batteries and selling it to Ford and GM when they finally decide they want to quit being losers and make electric vehicles. This company makes just that. So no brand. Here it is. It's actually a negative emissions truck. So it's better for it to actually be on the road than just sitting there still. Even better than battery. Uh, or all electric. Uh, so I like it fundamentally speaking. So if you make semis, why, why spend all the time on R&D when you can just buy this and, and, and call it a day? So fundamentally speaking, I like it. However, this run up right here, I think is just going to be a, a rumor run up. I think we're going to run up into the, uh, the, the merge date. That's where I'm going to lock a lot in probably if we get that sell off. I'm going to look at getting right back in at some of these previous zones. We'll see what zones we base out or see where we base out along the way. Before I let you go here, let's take it. Let's pull up the options chain real quick. S H L L. Now you can see we have September 18th. These aren't that liquid, but you can see we have it's supposed to happen on the 16th. You're running it pretty close. Oh man, is that all of them? You're cutting it pretty close right there. Unless this isn't loading, it's it's T O S. If it rhymes with P O S, you get what you pay for. <laughs> uh, this has been having problems lately, but. N not so much. We got some open interest here. Yeah, we're starting to come in a little bit. Got some volume today. If this does not close by the 16th, though, these will be toast. So if you're going to trade these, I would be out of these well before probably the 16th. Want to play a little bit safer? Grab the October 16th. Uh, you want to find something with a with a, a tighter tighter spread, probably some more volume. What are these? These are the. I think personally tomorrow I'll probably be looking at the 60s right here. I like that. 60s or or 40s. These are already in the money, so they'll just continue. As you can see, the delta, you know, 77 here versus 52. That's about a 50-50 shot of it, you know, expiring in the money. This is just about a 77% chance. Uh, but also deltas are rated per share basis. So as SHLL moves up one dollar that's like having 77 shares of this t that ticker versus having 52 so while you'll spend a little bit more you get a little bit bigger movement on that one so i wanted to, i'll leave you guys here with that uh let me know if you like these videos that's probably the play i'm looking at tomorrow uh we got the explosive move up i want to see how we interact you know we'll see how we do pre-market if it does gap down i see some profit taking 
I, I might wait. If we gap up, I might look for a, a quick snap back uh, to grab these calls. Um, if we just open up right now as we are, I'm probably going to uh, probably grab a couple of those. So that's my play. I'm already in it now as far as shares go. I'm looking to take an options play on it and take advantage of the run up. So I'll leave you guys here with that. Uh, comment down below. How do you like this video? Do you, Are you playing this in general? And if you're in my mentor group, how much are you up already? And what do you plan on doing with this? Uh, and I will see you guys. Check it out tomorrow. We're going to announce uh, the giveaway. I hit the 10K subscribers by my goal time. So tomorrow we're actually going to talk about that. So make sure you're here for tomorrow's live stream. And I will see you then.